How's it going everybody? Tim from Persistent Wolf Billiards here and today I'm going to be starting my video log of my growth as a player. Today I'm planning on making sure my stroke is straight so I'm going to show you one of the drills that I use to, to double check my stroke, make sure everything's in line as you see I have a straight line directly into the center of the pocket and today all I'm going to be doing is using follow coming down on the shot line and following the object ball into the pocket with the cue ball. So we come down straight and a little high make sure stroking straight through Obviously, on that one, we saw it went a little to the right. So, clearly, definitely wasn't a straight stroke through. We're going to come straight down. Center ball hit. Again, I'm a little bit going to the right. That time I went way to the right on this shot. So clearly when I'm coming in, I'm not on the center of the ball. So got to come a little to the left. Straight on. And again, it still went slightly to the right, so I'm still a little off center ball. So. I'm still a little off right, but it's a lot better as it did follow it in. So, that time I went a little to the left after the hit. Now ensuring that you're stroking straight through on a consistent basis eliminates that as one of the variables as to why you would miss a shot. As you can see, I definitely came to the left, which put unwanted left spin through the ball to the right after contact.
still a little off center. Now, this could also be just due to the positioning that I'm, I have the cue ball in correlation to the object ball. But I'm going to go ahead and say that it's very likely due to me not queuing straight. Now, one of the other ways I can check to make sure that my setup is accurate and it is a straight line is with good old fashioned laser level. Now, as you can see, the cue ball and the object ball are not centered on the line. So I'm just going to move this over just a bit. There we go. And I was very surprised to find out that even as little as an eighth of an inch can make a huge deal of difference when you're doing this row. Now, I had set up my projector to try to help out with this drill, but um, due to my mouse not being very high uh, DPI when I'm positioning the balls to set up you may notice that now I had to move them over a fraction of an inch they're not set up exactly where the projector was set up for them There we go. Now we're getting a little straighter. I still stopped my stroke, which I've got to work on. I want to have a good follow through. Now, I know you guys are going to comment down below about the fact that I chalk after every shot, even though. I don't need to, just a single shot over and over, but it's part of my pre-shot routine. And it's something that I do just to make sure that I'm, I'm following my routine in practice and in game. Now, even advanced players can benefit from this drill because sometimes they reach that plateau where they're doing great, doing great, doing great, and all of a sudden they 
something falls out of line. Well, every, every instructor that I've ever talked to says, go back to your fundamentals. Having a straight straw stroke is clearly a good fundamental. So, Okay, so this is a drill that I'm going to be continuing after I uh, turn off the camera today. Let me know in the comments below what you guys think would be another drill to help improve uh, the straightness of a delivery or the straightness of your stroke. And as always, strive for excellence and we'll see you in the next video.